Hello there, everyone. Wordy Wolf here for another exciting edition of Out of the Hat, the segment where I, Wordy Wolf, put names of city employees into my hat, I draw their name, one name, out of the hat, and then we ambush interview them to see what they are doing on their job. First of all, though, to get things started, camera operator Tim, please remove the chapeau. Oh, pff. Thank goodness. You have very cold hands. All right, now camera operator Tim, put the names into the hat, and then we will pick a name out of the hat, and the person we will be ambush interviewing is oh, our Public Works Director, Chris Petrie. He is at the Holyoke Water Tower. So follow me as we meet Public Works Director, Chris Petrie. Camera operator Tim, please put back the chapeau. That's a hat. Where is it? <sighs> Thank you so much. Oh, brother, I need to get a new camera operator. Well, we have now made our way to the Holyoke Water Tower, where on these grounds, Public Works Director Chris Petrie is inspecting things. Let's see if we can find him. This way. Here we are. Oh, there he is, ladies and gentlemen. Public Works doing? Director Chris Petrie, come on out here, Chris. All right. How Welcome. are you today? Great. How about you? Oh, I'm doing fantastic. I thought we'd go inside to see what it looked like inside the shaft of the water tower. Can we go inside? We surely can. Let's go in. Here we go. Oh, this is very exciting, folks. We are now inside the shaft of the water tower. Chris Petrie, tell me about this location. Where are we inside the shaft? Well, Wordy, we're on the mezzanine level of the water tower, which is the second floor. This is where all of the communications equipment, if you drive by, you see on water towers, a lot of them have antennas. This is where all of that equipment will be kept. So we're about 20 feet off the ground, up one flight of stairs, and then this is kind of the opening of the tower of the shaft. Above us is the two million gallons of water that this water tower holds. All right, well, now here's the big moment we've all been waiting for. Drum roll, please. Let's look up and see what it looks like. Whoa. There you are. Now, what's that belly button thing that's in the middle of that? That's the, that's the manway access to get up through the tank onto the top of the tank. So there's a tube right through the middle of the actual tank that gets you up up to the top of the tower where the navigation lights and all the antennas usually are. Well, so camera, oper ap camera operator Tim is showing us kind of a stairway that goes up. Is that if they need to go up and do maintenance? That's exactly what that's for, Wordy. That's uh, available for any staff to be able to climb the tank safely. You see the different things along the way and get up to that point that they can climb through the tank. So maybe at a future program, we could maybe go up there and see what it looks like up there? We might be able to do that. We'll have to train you in the proper uh, climbing techniques. Oh, I'd love it. Well, Chris, thank you so much for being on this edition of Out of the Hat. You're more than welcome. We'll see you next time, folks. This was very cool. Thank you, Chris. You bet.